Hello icons, welcome, welcome back to my channel. My name is Anna. If you guys are new here, I am the owner of Anavatari.com and in today's DIY video, I'm going to be showing you guys how to make this um, romper. Now, in order to make this romper, I'm going to use the old romper that I have and I'm going to help, I'm going to use the old romper to help shape the new romper that I'm making. So as you can see here, I have my old romper. I'm going to fold it in half and then pin everything together to make sure nothing shifts. And then once it's folded in half and everything is completed, I'm going to then place that romper on the fold of my fabric. I place the romper on the fold of my fabric I'm then going to take um, a pair of shorts that I have I'm going to place it right on top of the romper to match um, the parts and then basically just to give it a little bit more space if that makes sense because the romper that I have is a little bit shorter than I would like for it to be so I added a pair of shorts to help make the romper longer and then I'm just going to cut all the way around it For this top part of the romper um, to make the strings is totally optional. What I did here is I made mine a one piece. What you can do is just make an external string that connects to it, if that makes sense in any way. But yeah, so I basically, it's, it's up to your preference. I will also like for my romper to have a v-neck leg line so i'm just going to cut off um the excess pieces after cutting the front piece this is what it looks like on my table i'm then going to um, move on to the back piece Moving on to the back piece, I'm going to use the same um, process and steps as I did for the first one. I'm going to fold my um, jumpsuit over in half as well, but this time for the back, place it on the fold of my fabric, um, use the shorts um, on top of there as well to help me get an extended length towards the leg and then cut all the way around it as well.
from here we have three pieces one piece for the front and two pieces for the back i'm just going to demonstrate it for you guys to see what i'm talking about Once I put both pieces on each other, facing, um, make sure the right sides are touching each other. I'm then going to sew the side, um, the sides of this romper, and this is what it looks like. After sewing that, the next step will be to align the bottom parts of the romper, make sure everything is um, in correct order, pin it together, and then sew, sew the crotch part of the romper. So once that is completed, it should look something like this. And um, the final process of this romper will basically be to hem, um, hem the neckline and then hem the bottom of the romper. That's the final piece. And once um, you hem that, everything is completed. And this is the final outcome of my romper. I loved how it came out. If you guys did as much as I did, don't forget to like, comment, and share. And then um, I'll see you guys in my next video, okay? Bye.